morning. Skies remaining mostly cloudy throughout the twin tiers. Taking a look at this Weldboro sky cam. Mainly cloud cover, not too much going on here. A little bit of breezes today. Had temperatures reaching the low 60s. Meanwhile, having a little bit of wind to contend with as well. Temperatures remaining in those low 60s, looking at 61 currently in Bath. Can of Steel, 60 for the moment. 55 in Wellsboro, where you were just at, a little bit on the cooler side. Going further north, we go back up to 59 Watkins Glen, 60 in Penn Yan currently. This system is expected to bring us quite a bit of rain this weekend. Center of circulation, the low pressure system, mainly over Lake Michigan right now. And this cold front pushing pretty much through the heart of Ohio. Pretty soon those, those front uh, showers there are going to be approaching the Ohio-Pennsylvania border not too long from now. Our region for right now, mainly contending with clouds, not too much. A lot of these coming from the south and southwest. That's where, where that predominant wind is coming from as well uh, throughout the day. And speaking of that wind, as we go throughout the day tomorrow, we'll be contending with pretty decent wind gusts again as well, up into the 20 mile per hour range, especially these late morning and afternoon hours, about 11 to 3 o'clock is where we could see some of the highest wind speeds uh, going into tomorrow. Timing it out, we can really see that we have a bit of a tapering off on Friday. For Saturday, we start to see a couple of those reds and pinks, indicative of 30 to 35 mile per hour wind gusts. And this will just continue and continue throughout Sunday. And in some cases, we could even see some places get up to 40 mile per hour wind gusts. So the wind will be a harsh one as we make our way through the weekend. But mapping out what we can really expect, Friday is where that rain is going to start. It will be rolling in, intensifying as we get into Friday night. Overcast skies on Saturday, we'll continue that rain. They'll be likely on Saturday as well as getting probably most of those accumulations. And then Sunday tapering off in the morning, sun and clouds later on throughout the day. Taking a look at the future track, we can really get an idea of when the best chances of rain are going to be. Again, carrying over Friday night, a lot of that heavy stuff really starts to push through from the south, bringing in a lot of accumulations. And then Saturday, a lot of it this time coming in from the west as opposed from the south. And a couple areas up here, Ithaca and Watkins Glen, can expect it Saturday afternoon. Total accumulations will vary, but most places going to see around a half inch, maybe even up to three quarters of an inch, depending on the area. Five degree guarantee today, we're looking at 64, hit 62 just two degrees off and a bit on the low end. And tonight we'll be getting down to 51. Those winds will be sticking around. Windy but mostly cloudy skies as we carry into tomorrow. 64 once again for that five degree guarantee. Rain beginning in the afternoon and continuing throughout Saturday and into Sunday morning. But after which we should see a unseasonable warm up for next week. Getting to 62 by Tuesday, upwards of 68 by Thursday.